The Little Toucan and the Monkey by Ormelis Diaz. One day, early in the morning at the Montoso Rainforest, there was an ambitious monkey jumping from one branch to another around the forest. Suddenly, he saw a baby toucan who was standing happily in a branch of a big pine tree eating a piece of a delicious banana. Then the monkey started to compliment him and bother him at the same time. Dear baby toucan, how handsome you are. You have such beautiful feathers. You must be the future king of the forest. Why don't you sing something for me? I want to hear your sweet and nice voice. I like it so much and I want to hear it. The little toucan was doubtful and he said, I am so sorry, but I do not want to sing now. The monkey left for a couple of minutes, but then he came back again to try to convince the little toucan to sing for him. As the monkey was really interested in tasting a piece of banana from the baby toucan, he started telling him nice words again. Dear baby toucan, do not be so selfish. Sing for me now. I want to hear your melodious voice in this beautiful morning. None sing like you in the forest. The little toucan flew to a closer branch to please the monkey with his sweet voice. Just as he opened his mouth to sing, the sweet banana fell down where the monkey was waiting down below to eat. As soon as the ambitious monkey finished eating the piece of sweet banana from the toucan, he started laughing and making fun of the little toucan. Suddenly, a noisy and scary sound came from the forest. It was a bunch of hungry black coyotes looking for food. The ambitious monkey started running and tried to look for a place to be safe. He ran and jumped desperately from one branch to another, trying to avoid the hungry dogs. But unfortunately, he fell down and he could not stand up quickly. Eventually, the hungry coyotes ate him. The End